Donald Trump's absolutely baffling claim about phone apps raises new questions. HuffPost The former president seemed out of touch as he tried to describe a basic feature of any smartphone. Below are your comments. In 2016, candidate Trump promised to repeal and replace Obamacare. After he got into office, he said, nobody knew healthcare could be so complicated. Dot. Of course, Congress knew. During the same campaign, Trump promised that Mexico would pay for the southern border wall. He may or may not have. See more. The sad part was, Trump was actually referring to the phone. The phone is just another fad these youngsters are using from Trump's perspective. Trump was the guy who tried to take credit for inventing fire. Whenever Donald Trump learns something new, he instantly assumes that he is the very first person to ever have learned this previously unknown information. For instance, when Trump found out that Abraham Lincoln was a Republican, he assumed that because he had not known about Lincoln being a Republican, no one else could possibly have known that Lincoln had been a Republican. For days, he went around telling everyone that no one knew that Lincoln had been a Republican. This peculiar reaction to new information is part and parcel of Trump's pronounced narcissism. In a nutshell, Trump constantly projects his ignorance onto the rest of the world. Donald Trump seriously seems to believe that if he didn't know something, no one else in the world see. Old possibly have known that something. Now his base will come out and say that they took what he said out of context. And Trump knows about phone apps. In fact, Trump knows more about phone apps than anyone at Google or Apple. And Trump is actually developing an app that will be the greatest app in history. Well, actually it is a concept of an app. But people have heard about it and said that it is beautiful. I hope the Harris team turns most people don't have any idea what a phone app is into an ad very key. CKLY. Trump came down the escalator to announce his first campaign for president in June 2015. I think we've had enough. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.